All right, so we say thank you for um, keeping the faith and for being there. This is the time you have been waiting for, the time we bring developers of real estate, the buying public, and the financial institution to the transaction table. We show and help you um, close those property deals with the support of available financial institution, courtesy M.I. Okoro and Associates. Yeah, of course, the professional representing <laughs> the household name M.I. Okoro in real estate and property is here with us. And uh, it's always a pleasure having him. I asked him if he brought us any <laughs> uh, giveaway plots plots of land as Christmas uh, gift, but he hasn't quite answered <laughs> that. So let me help welcome you to the program this thank, week. Thank you, John. Thank so you. So it's, it's always thank good. You know, the verbal word doesn't, it doesn't do, even if you said stick. Stick. Unless you have those documents. <laughs> According to them, the documents must be right. Yeah. So the topic for this week is commercial real estate. Now, tell us what is commercial real estate. All right, um, Helen, um, compliments. Uh, John, compliments. good to see you. Snap them out. <laughs> <laughs> well, well uh, uh, good morning, viewers. Uh, well, let's start with, um, let's have that um, simple, simple explanation of um, commercial real estate. Mm. Uh, commercial real estate is, um, is that property that um, generates, has that potential to generate um, income, income or profit through um, either capital gains or rental incomes. Mm -hmm. yeah. So once you have any property, any property that can generate um, income for you, whether yearly or weekly or mm -hmm. monthly, it, it could be classified as um, commercial properties. Okay. And it's also very important that we, ha we understand this. Despite that we have commercial properties and residential properties, there are residential properties that, that also can be um, classified as commercial properties. Yeah, that is when you rent out part of your residence. Yes, and when, you know, there are properties that are single family units. Yes. just Where purely. you have just purely for your family. Yeah, that, that, that's full residential. Yeah, full residential. There are also residentials where probably yeah. um, high-rise buildings where you have flats. Okay. It's fully residential. But okay. for the investor, mm -hmm. it's a business for him. Okay. So does this expansion that you just made now, does it represent the commercial real estate um, um, types as we have them in Nigeria? Yes, it is, it's important. Within those types, like we have um, the industrial commercial real estate, mm. where you talk about the manufacturing, where warehousing, logistics, okay. those, yes, is people put up those buildings to rent it out to industries, to come and rent and start manufacturing things mm. so that's it's also commercial real estate for the investor he is only investing in in the profit to gain mm. and the capital appreciation of his investment mm. when because some properties you can buy some properties with the aim that you want to um, make rentals from it and at the same time over time through the appreciation that the property must have um, garnered you sell it off mm. yeah. so those are, are part of the things in uh, commercial real estate they will have like um, hostels. It's also part of um, uh, commercial real estate. People build hostels for students to rent. Yeah. Hotels is also uh, hospitality. Yeah. It's also part of commercial real estate. These are properties. All have to do with properties. But it all depends on the mindset of the investor here. Can I play devil's advocate here? Okay. What about churches? Ah, <laughs> we shouldn't go there, please. Go there. We shouldn't go there. <laughs> These are house of God, so we don't, we don't classify. No, 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 no. Let's, let's leave that one. Let's leave it. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, what, what would you say, um, what type of commercial property would you classify as very profitable? Well, um, they are all the beauty about um, commercial real estate that it allows you here maybe like um, the developer or the investor to to be creative okay you know it's all about um, the square meter of a, of, of, of a space mm. um, like um, if you talk about re residential properties you can have probably four or five bedroom apartments and the rent house can be specific within what is going on within that environment it can be okay. maybe like let's say four million or five million mm. for rental for one year yeah. but that same amount of space in a commercial environment, could fetch you. You could fetch you a whole lot. Yeah. You can turn it to offices. You can turn it to um, like rentals. Those that are doing um, shopping complexes, mm. Mm. Um, retail malls, and all that. So the the, the beauty about um, what the profit 
imagine um, commercial properties can bring is all about what is in your mind. How creative And that's are you? where M.I. Okoro comes in. Yes. 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 The creativity. Yes. 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 So, once um, the underlying factor there is you should look at what brings that huge return on investment. Yeah. Mm. Mm. yeah. All right. That ROI is very important. And where you have human traffic. Mm -hmm. Because anything you do, you must consider where, where is that traffic? Where is human beings going? Yeah. Once you have that human traffic, the tendency that the tenants in such given building will be more. Mm. Once you think of a place where you're going to have um, high tenants, okay. tens, hundreds of, depending on the, the, the idea of the complex you're putting up. Mm. So once you have, you have planned it out, you have high volume of tenants, mm. and you have good return on investment, that can yeah, make yeah, a very good... good um, yeah. So location uh, is key. Very key. Mm. All right, they say seeing is believing. We have um, a video that will tell us more about what facilities MI Okura and Associates have at the moment. Let's get that information and we'll be back for more. What is happiness? They said a man is truly happy only in his own home. That is why we present you with a deluxe located in a serene environment in the heart of Lagos. Welcome to the Parliament. A development of 3D homes, a brand new multiple unit of four and two bedroom terrace duplex, finely crafted and designed carefully to a taste with beautiful views from every side. All duplex features modern facilities such as inbuilt speaker system, excellent drainage system, central water treatment plant, fully fitted kitchen, swimming pool, all room in suit, ample parking space, CCTV cameras, 247 security, 24 hours electricity, and fully serviced. Lekki Equa Expressway, beside Northwest Oil Filling Station, VGC Lekki Lagos. Price, four bedroom terrace, 65 million naira. Two bedroom terrace, 45 million naira. For more inquiries, please call. Wow. <laughs> Highly informative, I must say. Yeah. And, you know, guess what? I also hear that uh, I tell you, the shops are going very fast. Very fast. Yeah? Very fast. Confirm that to us. <laughs> <laughs> very fast. You know, it's just like, um, like what we are treating them today, commercial real estate. Mm. Uh, uh, let, me, let me give you an example. Um, it's a story. There's someone that um, invested in, um, in a shopping center here in Lekki. Uh, and um, when he got a property that was around, he bought it maybe around seven million. Mm. And um, the moment he bought that property, from the first day he started, because we, we switched, we gave him um, a tenant mm -hmm. as his buying, because we already okay. have people that are ready for rentals. Yes. Mm. So as his buying, we don't, what we just need to do is to do the formal introduction. This is your new landlord. Mm. We are no longer your landlord. This is your tenant. Mm -hmm. So he, he started immediately to make rent, a rental income from that property. Mm. So over time, he, he owned that property for, let's say, three years. And he sold that property after. Mm -hmm. mm. So he made gains from one, rental? from the rentals. And now, the value he sold that property was over times two or times three. Wow. So you see the beauty in that. And within a short period of time. Mm. And you, the thing with um, commercial real estate is it, it doesn't take out the fact that residential real estate is also not good. But we are now emphasizing more on um, commercial. commercial. Mm -hmm. Now, the thing, commercial real estate is so f wonderful that the one we're doing in Tejo Shona, where we started, we have over, over 650 shops we are selling for Zenith Bank. Mm -hmm. And when we started, we, we brought in all these um, uh, the trading unions, mm. the, those are in, in trading, mm. where we had meetings with them. And the beauty of the thing is that the so bank they also... lump sum and they resold. Re so we have, we have classes there. We have those that are 
just bought and they are using it for themselves. Mm -hmm. Now we also have investors yeah. that have also bought and we mm -hmm. got That's tenant it. for them. Yeah. So it was an easy stop for them. So instead of having um, your funds tied down somewhere, we, we encouraged people then to bring in your money in Tejo Show, and which we are still encouraging people now because we have some units left. Yeah. Because the thing is selling like um, it's selling very fast, and um, traders that are there are enjoying it. So once you have a place that is comfortable for business, like in sh shopping complexes, it's comfortable and um, the ambience is good. The shopping experience is fine for those that are coming to shop. Okay. And the investors are also having huge return on investment. Perfect. All right. In a minute, apart from Tejo Show, um, what other commercial properties is MI Okoro and Associate offering? at this point in time we also okay. have we we have a property that um there's this popular uh, market uh in uh, lake in towards the um, Ibeju lake area where we are also um encouraging people to come in and buy it's also um, a shopping center too okay. it's, it's something that is is very good people well especially now that um the buildings is, when you come in now you're going to get good bargain Mm -hmm. because we are building the market space for, for now. Mm -hmm. So is, that one is okay. also good. And we also have something that we are uh, also telling those that are, because we have some residentials that purely are for commercial purposes, for investors. Mm -hmm. yeah. With people that don't want to rent, we have those properties. We want investors to come and buy the properties. We have people that are willing to rent those properties. And you have the here. banks that are also willing to support. Absolutely. Mortgage That's a beautiful is, thing about your it, project. Yes. What we do is just like the one we have in um, Tejo Show. We have Zenit Bank to provide the mortgage there. And it's been wonderful. So we have other properties that we have Polaris Bank mm. to also provide a mortgage. You can't take out in, in insane climes, insane environments. You, developed countries, you can't so the think of. Is, it's the there. Financing goes with the. It's there. It's easy. Yeah. It's easy with it the finances. Life. It makes it, it makes, easy for. It makes life easy for for investors and people that are working to invest. And final word, in thirty seconds. Just make sure you you <laughs> work with us. As work with us and we'll provide that um, professional service that you want. We'll, we'll have a tailor made um, solutions to all your investment properties. And there's needs. no doubt, no doubt about okay. that. It's all about solutions yeah. and getting you closer to owning your own property yeah. all too soon. Our time is out. A final word. You have just given that to us. And um, that man who is procrastinating, move now. That yeah. woman, move now. Okay? <laughs> Talk to M.I. Okoro and Associates. Yeah. yeah. So our job is done today. Uh, thanks to Chief Mbakwe on behalf of uh, M.I. Okoro and Associates. We shall see you next week. Yeah, sure. Sure, that'll sure. be Christmas Day. Uh, Christmas. That's the Eve. That's, that's Just the before. No, it's Christmas Day. Christmas actually. Eve. Yeah, it's Christmas, Christmas is Sunday. It's the day it's the 24th. Yeah, sure. Never mind. I'm already in the general. <laughs> <laughs> Anyhow, <laughs> thanks a million. Thanks All right. And she's Thank in the house. And um, as usual, she will be breaking tables today. It's that time for lifestyle and wellness segment with Farah Shonuga. Join her after the break. <laughs>